Hello YouTube, thought I'd do a quick video. I've been asked, can you hook up any audio device uh, to your GMRS 2A radio and have it be transmitted over the air? And the answer to that is yes. Yes you can technically. As long as the device you want to hook up has a speaker out jack. So, you could take your GMRS radio, you're only going to need one cable because you're just playing the sound coming from one device. So you, you just need one cable. You won't need the um, ground loop uh, isolator block because you're just using one cable. But, but yes, you can take, as long as your device has got a, a headphone jack and remember to turn the volume up, but as long as you got a headphone jack and turn your volume up on the device because remember the sound that comes out of here has to be up because you this would hook up on the speaker out of the device will go to the microphone in on the handheld then make sure you turn on your vox setting turn on your vox sensitivity all the way up and also disable if your radio has it it's called the TOT the transmit timer out function and they have that uh, option in there so that you know if you're on a repeater or well I guess they don't even have to be a repeater but they have it in there so that if your button on your two-way radio gets stuck and it keys up the transmit button gets stuck and it keys up after so many minutes which whichever you can set it to it will stop transmitting automatically but you can disable that if you choose to so but yeah, you can hook up any device and play it. Now, obviously, this device you can play it by itself. You don't, you know. I'm just using this for an example. But you can hook up any device and just plug it into the cable, turn the volume up, and then Vox setting on, and um, make sure the volume, like I said, the volume's up on the device, and you can play whatever. Now you ask yourself, well, what, why would I need to do that? Well, let's just say for an example, you you want to listen to um, a police scanner. And the police scanner does not get good reception in the area you want to listen it at. So you would relay it through the GMRS radio to another radio that you would have on yourself to listen to it Um that's just one example. Or the Weather Channel. Yes, I know some of these radios can get Weather Channels programmed in here. But I'm just using that for an example. Let's say you had a weather radio. A real nice one. That has better features or whatever the case may be. And you want to play it. It's a base model and you can't really carry it with you. But you want to you know, play it. Uh, you're out in the field or something. Well, as long as it's got a speaker out, Jack, you can hook up to it and uh, have it be transmitted through the GMRS radio. Now make sure you select the right plugs you need on the device that you need to hook it up to. Um, I now I'll post a link in the description. I did a video about different types of plugs so you have an idea what type of plug that you're going to need. Now um, like I said you can even hook up to a, up to a laptop and have it play music off the internet you know it, it whichever as long as it's got an audio jack out or, or a headphone jack out you can have it be transmitted through the GMRS radio just make sure you turn the volume up on the device you're you're using to tr to get the sound from turn your volume up and you don't need the ground I uh, ground loop isolator block assembly because you're just using one cable so keep that in mind um, is it legal to do this well I, I'm sure if you set up a big uh, you know big base station and you're planning on retransmitting your favorite FM radio station 24 7 or oh, you'll probably eventually get someone knocking on your door uh, but for occasional use, I don't think they're going to really come banging on your door. Um, but if you need to use it to do it for an hour or two or whatever the case may be, you know, there's a weather. Another good example. 
maybe there's a bad storm coming and you're you're taking your you need to go down in this valley type of situation and you cannot get the weather channel in so you could have the weather radio be on top of the of the hill and you can hook it up to your GMRS to get down in the valley and hear the the weather report you know another one or out in a field or whatever the case may be but that's um kind of neat about this you can use it for emergency situations and it's not a big deal or even you know you want to play a little bit of a you know music or whatever i mean like i said as long as you don't do it 24 7 and you know try to make a big transmitting tower uh i don't think you're going to have any problems but an occasional doing this is not going to be a, a real big deal um but yeah those are some good examples especially in emergency situations like i said um th there's a little give you know there's a little give in the you know emergency situations uh so keep that in mind but anyway any i just want to do a quick video to say yes you can hook up any audio source and have it be transmitted uh over the uh two-way radio as long as that particular auto source does have a uh, speaker out or a headphone jack out on it just make sure you turn the volume up any uh questions or comments post them down below and please subscribe and thank you and have a good day